What's up, YouTube? I came to do this look for you guys today. And this is the look. And I use this Chanel palette. And these are the colors right here. And I use all of these colors, every single one of them. And that's it. I use Cat Fight Lipstick by NARS and Kitten Lip Gloss by Stila. And for blush, I use Sweetest Coco. Thank you, Wolves. Yeah, Sweetest Coco. And that's it. This is the look. So I hope you like it. On to the video. Okay, so first I'm going to start out with my NARS eyeshadow base. And then I'm going to take Paint on the Paint Pot by MAC. And take a little on my finger and just put it on my lid. And then I'm going to take this um, brush that I got from Coastal Sink. Which is just... Uh, it was, I don't know, I can't remember what the brush was called for, but uh, it don't have a name on it, and I got it from Coastal Scent. I mean, not Coastal Scent, Crown Brushes. So, yeah, I'm going to use that to then the paint pot in. And this brush do shed a lot. That's why I don't use it for nothing but to blend my eye shit, I mean, the, a base on my eye with. For that, it do a good job. Serve a kind of good purpose. Besides picking all that crap off your lid. But anyway, just blend that in. And then I'm going to take the Chanel palette. Um, and it's called, I don't know, but I'll show it, show it to you guys. And I'm going to be using the majority of these colors. I'm going to use that color for a highlight, lid, lid, crease, and maybe lid. But first I'm going to take texture and put it in my crease. I'm just going to use a Smashbox blending brush. Well, I'm going to use the same brush and I'm going to take this white shade right here and highlight my brow bone. These pretty, pretty colors in this um, palette. And go in this first color right here and apply that to the inner third of my eye and my tear duct area.
like that. Then I'm going to go in this color on the side of it, right here, this color, and I'm going to place that right on the side of the color that I just put down. Then I'm going to color on the side of that, which is this one right here, and it's a gray, silverish, black infused color. And I'm gonna put that on the side of the color that I just used. And then before I lay another color, I'm just going to go back through these three colors and blend the colors that's already in my lid together. Starting with that pink one and just like lightly, lightly put it on there. Then I'm going to the next one to blend out that gray color. And then back into the purple blend on top of both of those so it should look something like that so I'm gonna do the other side show you the difference so I'm gonna do the other side real quick so it should have something like that and then I'm going to take a uh, 222 and go in this color right here, which is the last color in this palette. And I'm going to apply that to my crease. I don't be trying to make these videos long, y'all. But uh, I know you be like seeing some videos be sped up and stuff like that. And I speed, I sped a couple of mine up, but... I know some people can't see really what you're doing when you speed the video up and don't talk through it. So, if I or like make anybody mad or something because I don't be quicker with it, I'm sorry. Hey, it's people that can't really see what you be tell what you be doing when you speed them up. Like, and, and I am gonna still speed up some of mine, but I just like to make them so you guys can really see and explain what I'm doing but anyway I'm gonna take this to right where your arch and your brow start to go a bit and I'm gonna stop right there with the color and drag it out just a little and I'm gonna do the same on the other side and pull it out and then while I stopped out with this color right here I'm going to take this brush and just blend over it a little bit on both sides and then I'm going to take a, two uh, a 224 and blend it. Just blend all the color. And 
then I'm going to take the two thirty nine back and go in this last color right here and run it uh, along my whole lower lash line. And connect it to the top. And like I said, connect it to the bring it all the way in to where you applied the first inner tear duct area color. And then I'm going to take this card, which is in this card right here. For some reason, this one is darker than the original carbon that I have. That's why I use it a lot. But anyway, I'm going to take that and take a pencil brush and define my crease a little more. So I'm going to take it on my brush and just place it like right on, right in my crease. And drag it down to my lower lash line. And I'm going to do the same on the other side. Just right in my crease. And then I'm going to drag it down. And then I'm going to blend it with my 239, 224. Just lightly, lightly blend over it because I don't want to blend too much of the color away. You can skip this step if the color that you use is already dark enough. But I like to make my outer V dark than the darker than the rest of my eye. But darker than the colors that I put in the crease. I like to make it darker. And then I'm gonna go along my lower lash line and just blend it out a little bit. So you should have something like that. And then I'm going to take saffron, which is a color that I've been feeling in love with, and apply that in my crease. Just a tiny bit with a different 224 brush with a clean one. So I'm just going to just like get just a little not that much and take it off and just lightly run it through my crease. From beginning to end. I'm going to do the same on the other side. Then I'm going to take this 210 by MAC and line my upper lash line. And I'm going to use feline for my lower lash line. And just start from wherever you feel comfortable with starting it. And I'm going to kind of like make a cat eye. And then what's left on the brush, I'm going to just go on in the rest of my eye with it. And I'm um, do the other side. And I'm using black track fluid line.
Then I'm going to go over that with this carving again to set it, but I'm gonna do the rest of my face. So I'm gonna zoom out. And I'm going to take uh, this select cover up in NC45. I'm shaking it up. And I'm going to apply it to the back of my hand. And I'm going to take this 130 and go under my eyes with it and, and put conceal on it. And just blend it. And feel free to use your finger. And because I used the color that was that is for my skin tone, I'm not going to use my MAC today. I'm going to just use this Bobbi Brown. I use this Bobbi Brown Golden Orange. And it's just a loose powder. And I'm going to take that and set my concealer on, on this Billy B brush. Take a little more. And as for the rest of my face, I'm going to take this uh, Gold Blu-ray and just go around my face. I'm going to use the same brush. And just like dust it on. And that's it. I'm going to take, um, I'm going to use this blush. I'm going to use this blush in, um, sweet as cocoa. With the Ability B brush. And you smile. Top of my cheekbone. Right. And I'm going to use this NARS lipstick in Cat Fight. And it's just like a muted pinkish brownish color. Still lip glass and kitten. And it's a pinkish goldish color. It's 
to watch it for you. And I'm going to use it. And that's it. I'll be back with pictures and I hope you enjoyed the little piece.